Yo, what is up guys? We are back for another edition of Release Rewind. And today we are talking about some of the greatest units. And I just realized I forgot to pull up freaking <laughs> uh, Gogeta. Wait, hold on. One second, one second. Come take a little trip with your boy. Take a little trip with me. Oh my God, can you load, please? Please and thank you. Thank you. Okay. Now, back to the intro. We are here to talk about the third year anniversary LR in Vegito and LR Physical Go G Um, we're more so gonna be talking about their um their normal forms before the EZA as opposed to after. I'll mention them after, of course, but um yeah, we're gonna be talking about them beforehand, so think it's the third year of Dokkan. They announced this, they release and they are some of the most fun units ever they come with a terrible fusion condition that you almost never saw but when you got it oh my god incredible they towered over the game they were amazing in every sense of the word everything was perfect with these guys for the only thing i would have changed was this condition but everything else was perfect they were so strong they were killing everything in their path oh my god these these guys were like i know like we're looking at this passive these uh these super attack effects this leader skill we're looking right now you know in 2023 and it's just like yo these guys look like they suck and i mean yeah pretty easy a by today's i mean even but even with the easy by today's standards they kind of suck but what you have to understand bro come 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 take come take a time travel with with your boy all right come hop in the time machine third year anniversary it's the first anniversary that they drop lrs right because they didn't drop it for the second i don't believe so i think it was the agl super saiyan 4 vegeta and the str super saiyan 4 goku and they were tur's um yeah it's the first anniversary if i'm not mistaken that had lrs and it's of two iconic moments vegito and goat jita amazing um so like looking at their passives like they're they are identical when um when they're in base right but then they transform, they actually differ a lot. Now, I will say, Gogeta was a little slighted. Vegeta was definitely better. Vegeta was definitely better. Um, so let's let's just start with Vegeta. Um, he counters. Bro, listen. This guy's countering was crazy. He was blitzing the game, man. He was blitzing the game it was incredible it was amazing to see so you would definitely want to go full crits for this guy he was countering 150 percent attack and defense on the start of turn and three key in addition per rainbow keys for he was always 18 key supering he was countering all over the place he could tank like no other amazing godly link set bro he was just he was everything we could have dreamed of from a Super Vegito transforming unit. And then Gogeta, um, I'm not gonna lie, not as good. So to compensate for Ve for Vegito getting the counter, Gogeta only got super effective against all types. Again, in that day and age, amazing, but it, he wasn't doing as much damage. He definitely wasn't. Everything else about them was the same. Um, but yeah, so Vegito was definitely the better option I mean, they were they were like 1A and 1B, though. Like, I think Vegito was better, but I wouldn't say he was like leagues better. Absolutely wasn't. Bro, that, yo, this Vegito was different. I got Gogeta different, too. Don't get me wrong. But these, both of them were different. Like, okay. So, like, who was around? What, let's let's go on a little trip, right? Um, I'm going to go on the... Let's do the global campaign. Why not? Oh, uh, wait. Hold on. I messed up. 
Um, I just want to look to see who was around in 2018. Who was actually around? Let's see. Um, okay, yeah, this is it's the anniversary part one. Yep, yep, yep. Where are the banners? Where are the banners? Yeah, there we go. Um, well, we could look at their banners, right? We could definitely look at their banners. That's the Vegito banner. Um, yeah, wow. You had the AGL Super Vegito. He was, he was still great, though. He was still amazing. Physical Super Vegito was still great. This guy was still great. These guys... Did they not just come out with him? I think so. No, I don't think so. These guys did, though. I remember that. Um, these guys were cool. Uh, yeah. And then you had this. Who'd they have? Yeah, you had all the Gogetas. Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta wasn't even that old. It was like a few months old. This guy was still good. I don't know... Uh, and Janemba was incredible for like the longest. Uh, crazy man, crazy. So yeah, you, you had comp in 2018, but once these guys came out, it's just like no. There's a clear number one. There is a clear as day number one in the game, and it was these two guys. Now again, if you want to nitpick. You can say Vegito was better, I agree. So if you want to say Vegito was number one, Gogeta was number two, I agree. But me personally, I have him at 1A and 1B. Mainly because you were very rarely seeing Gogeta or Vegito anyway. You were mostly in these forms, right? You were mostly here. So, yeah. And plus, I, I don't know, I just, I got biased towards Gogeta. I don't know. That's swaggy, man. Gogeta's the good, bro. Vegito's amazing too, though. But, uh, yeah, these guys on release, incredible. Now, they're easy A's, right? Uh, they did easy A. They easy A during the seventh anniversary. Um, their easy A's were strong on release, but that was more so because almost no units were geared towards Red Zone. They were, like, some of the only units geared towards Red Zone. So, because of that, like, they were some of the best units. They did quickly age, though, unfortunately. Like, um... Got a little bit more stats. Uh, you know, Vegito got medium chance to crit, medium chance to dodge. That was it. Um, they couldn't change their fusion condition. Uh, very unfortunate. Uh, Gogeta got the same thing. Um, and then when they fused, uh, yeah, when they fused, um, Vegito got greatly raised defense, which, which definitely did help. Vegito definitely became even better than Gogeta. He got 200% attack and defense start of turn. He countered. He had damage reduction for three turns, 30%, and then he had 15% start from the fourth turn. See, but it's not a lot, though. That's not a lot of damage reduction. That wasn't really protecting for much. And then Gogeta. Um, they gave Gogeta super effective against all types, and they gave him a crit, a guaranteed crit, and a high chance of evading enemies' attack for three turns. I, I, I like that's so annoying like either give him super effective or crit don't give him both it's really redundant and then it went down to a high chance to crit and a medium chance to dodge start from the fourth turn so it's like yeah Vegeta was definitely more consistent um it's unfortunate I feel like they could have made their easy is a lot better because it's like before they transformed though like they weren't crazy at all before they transformed like they actually were not crazy at all uh, yes, I don't think they made these guys too great, easy A-wise, which, you know, very unfortunate, but I can't sit here and act like these guys don't have a big place within Dokkan history, an important place within Dokkan history, because me personally, the third anniversary was my, I believe, my first anniversary. Um, amazing, amazing, so much hype, so much fun summoning for these units, so much fun playing with this unit so much fun trying to get this awful condition <laughs> oh god this condition was terrible but hope you guys enjoyed this edition of release rewind you know more dokkan battle videos coming to a computer or a mobile device or a playstation or an xbox whatever you're watching this on near you like and subscribe for more dokkan battle content such as this i'm gonna catch you on the next one i'm out peace
Uh, I actually have no idea what unit I'm gonna do next. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna keep that a secret though. I'm gonna keep it a secret. I'll 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 come up with it. Bye. <laughs>